Okay, first of all, this is my very first I'm not even uh, GoPro it. video ever, so I very much apologize for the yeah. amateur production. Uh, I posted it because I am just, uh, I just could not be more impressed with the, well, uh, this, I've got the, the Scott Sector rod here. Uh, fly rod I'm using. It is their 8 foot no 4 inch, uh, 6 <laughs> yeah, exactly. weight. Uh, I actually have two of them. I actually, I bought one, oh, loved it so much. Uh, I use it a lot up here in uh, northern Michigan for. Uh, uh, Smallmouth. Uh oh, already uh, into the back end. I have two of those. I have two of the eight weight uh, and, and one of the ten weight uh, in that eight foot four inch uh, configuration. And the reason I have it is uh, I, I do a lot of blind casting. Uh, I'm not as young as I used to be, so that it, it, so the, I really appreciate the the freakishly light swing weight it has. Um, uh, but that does not come at the expense of power. It's got all the power I need. I, I use a heavy line. I use the uh, uh, SA uh, Seamless Density uh, S5, S7, and uh, I throw big flies uh, with that thing. Um, probably uh, streamers that belong on a seven or eight weight. Um, yeah, that six in. weight handles them just I don't fine. Know if he just right now I'm fishing a, a deceiver, which is very easy for that rod. Uh, well, Probably I think it's on a one on. And uh, I'm off the dock the here on Sunset Key. You can see Key West across the, uh, the channel yeah. there. And I'm hooked into something, and just as it is with salt water, you don't know what you're, you've got until you lay eyes on it. Uh, but I, I posted oh, this because pole, uh, I think it's just an impressive uh, demonstration of uh, what that little six weight can do. Because it's a, you're going to see at the end if you hang around, uh, it's a healthy yeah, no, uh, uh, yellow jack. <laughs> I would, I'm going to say eight, eight, five, eight, five pounds, eight pounds. Um, I'm not good with my salt water weights. But uh, anyway, enjoy the video and. If you like it, thumbs up would be great. I'm not looking to monetize it, but I'd be interested in any comments uh, uh, that you might have as well. Thanks for watching. Here, Dave, can I ask you to uh, well, videotape yeah, with this just in okay. case the... Just in case it is really something? Well, okay. it's something. It's definitely something. There we go. Is Thanks. it on? Yep. Yeah. All right, so it says push the button. Yeah, I gotta push. I gotta push. Dave, I just want to see what it is. There it is. Sun, so I can see what he is. That's a big, it's a bigger, is that a jack? That's a big, that's a jack. What a blast. Hey Dave, look at this. <laughs> 
Oh, check this out. There's one right behind him. There's, right, there's one swimming with him. Look at that. No, that's a, that's actually, it looks like another jack. Yeah, it's a big shot. Oh, wow. All right. Now, how to get him off. Oh, there is. What is that underneath him? Oh, this is, no, I don't know what that is. Actually, it's not a shark. It looks like one. Yeah, there's something chasing them. Oh, this is fun, Dave. That was a good spot. That's a great fish. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try to hand line them in. Would you? Um, what do you mean? Yeah, just, I, yeah, go ahead. I got it. No, he's not done. He's not done. What's under there? It's the cold. Oh, that's what he had. Okay. Yeah, it's under. Two wet line out with the jam. There we go. There you go. Well, that's very exciting. This is, uh, Exactly what I was looking for. We've caught those on spinning gear about that size and they are a great fight. Alright, let's try this again. Thank you. Because you're going to be able to get that out pretty easy. Yeah. Well, you got a perfectly I did. for that fight. Yeah. You couldn't have hooked him in a better spot. How about this? I'm sure you want a picture. <laughs>